Hey guys, so today we're going to be trying out the Hydro Liquid Shadow from LA Splash. I have four colors here to swatch and show you. So if you guys are curious to see the swatches and how these apply, then just keep watching. So these are the four colors I have right here. We have, oh, do these not have names on them? Oh, they do, on the bottom. We have Elite, which is like a deep cranberry red. We have Poise, which looks silvery blue. We have Plush, which looks like an emerald green. And we have Boss, which looks like a beautiful copper color. So let's start with swatches. Okay, so here are the shades. We have Elite. We have Poise, Boss, and Plush. So here are the shades. I will do a close-up swatch right here for you. Okay, so I'm kind of in like the greenish mood, so why don't we try Plush? on the lid and we'll see how well it will blend out with a shadow brush. And then on the other side, maybe we'll try to layer things on top and see what we can do. Okay, so I have the Maybelline Eye Contour Brush. This is part of the Gigi Hadid collection. So we're going to try this. These do feel very wet when you apply them. Like you can definitely feel the hydration, um, but once they dry, it doesn't look like they're going anywhere. Oh, that one wasn't dry. Sorry. But once they're dry, it doesn't feel like they're going anywhere. So let's give this one a try. So I'm just going to brush it onto the lid and see how well it blends out. It's definitely shearing out quite a bit. Okay, all I'm seeing now is sparkle and like a wash of green. Not liking it applied that way. Let's try a different way. I'm gonna try putting a little color in the crease and then dabbing this on with my finger on the lid only to see if that works. Okay, so now that we have like the green shadow going, let's try this shadow again. This time I think I'm just gonna brush it on and just use this tool. And then maybe I'll just pat out the very outer edge. Okay, so as I was patting at the edge of the shadow, it completely took the shadow off of my eyelid. So this product is not very easy to work with. So I will try putting a second layer and seeing if it just dries naturally without patting it out. We'll see what happens. Okay, now that it's mostly dry, let me see if I can soften the edge a bit. Okay, that worked. I was able to soften the edge, but the shadow still looks patchy, so let me try another layer. Okay, so that actually looks nice. I'm gonna try to soften this edge just one more time. Okay, pretty. So the trick to these shadows is that you wanna apply one layer, let it dry, 
Blend out the edge, then apply a second layer until you have the desired opacity that you're looking for in a cream shadow. I think this turned out really pretty. The other way that you can use them is perhaps on the lower lash line. So let's try this on the lower lash line. I'm gonna grab a little pencil brush and see if we can kind of dust it along the lower lash line. This is my Sigma pencil, my E30 pencil brush. I think I'm just gonna take a little bit off of here. We'll try this on the inner corner and see what happens. And same as before, you need to let it dry before you start messing with it. Let's try a second layer. I'm going to try putting it on directly with this little applicator wand. Look how intense that is, whoa. And as soon as you start messing with it with a brush, it starts getting patchy and flaking off. So this is not a product that you wanna use brushes with until they are fully dry. I just made a mess of this eye product. And so you saw it in action. It's a pretty finicky product, but once it's on there, it's not going anywhere. So here are the four swatches of the ones that I tried. Like I said, I swatched this one before it was dry. They're dry now, they're not budging. So if you're looking for something affordable, I always have a discount code for LA Splash Cosmetics down below if you guys are interested in giving them a try. Um, my suggestion, wait until they are dry, then blend out the edges. Do not touch them while they are wet or you will just mess up your entire look. So if you guys enjoyed this swatch and try on of the LA Splash Hydro Liquid Shadows, if you did, please give this video a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and as always, I will see you in my next video. Bye guys.